Hello my friends and welcome to another video of my channel. In this video I'm going to talk about the widget image view. I will show you five different ways to set an image to the image view. If you are ready, let's get started. But remember to subscribe the channel and hit the bell button to be aware about new videos. Let's go. I built a new project and named it image view example. Here I have a text view and I don't need it. I'm going to delete it. Then I'm going to drag and drop an image view here. Immediately a window will be opened. I'm going to check this avatar as the source of the image view. Okay. For different purposes, we may use an image view. First of all, the main purpose and the most simple purpose is to use an image view as a banner to show a fixed photo. For this, we need to set a photo on our image view. We can do it here in activity underscore main. Here you can search for foreground. And here by clicking on this, you can select the image. But before that, remember that you have to add or let's say copy and paste an image into the driver folder. Here I add this photo, which is my logo into the driver photo. And here for the foreground, I'm going to choose it. And it will be set onto the image view. But remember, uh, if you have a big image like that, it won't be fixed onto the screen. So you will not be able to see it onto the screen of the emulator. For this, you have to decrease a bit the size of the image view. Here I'm gonna set 200 dp for the width and for the height of my text uh, sorry my image view and i think it will be good now let's check it on emulator okay as you see we have the image view into the middle of the screen and the logo is fixed to it so Consider now we don't have this image here set onto the image view and we want to dynamically set uh, different photos during the using the application and we don't know which photo the user will be uh, set onto the image view. For this purpose we have four main ways uh, to set a photo through the cut line codes uh, onto our image view. Now I'm gonna add a button here. If you don't know how to use a button, I'm gonna put the link of uh, a video about the button on top of the screen and you can stop the video, watch that first and then come back here. I'm gonna call this button set image huh. okay I want to build an application and whenever I'm clicking on the set image button uh, this image will be set on this and before that there is no image set on the image view and it will be empty so in the screen we will see only the button let me check it okay as you see there is only button and there is no function for this button let's go to main activity dot kt here First of all, we have to initialize our image view and our button. 
okay there is four main ways to do it i'm gonna add the uh, set on click listener this function uh, for the button and by this whenever we are pressing the button the code that we are writing between these two curly braces will be executed the most simple way is this image dot set image resource and then we have to give the address of the image which is resources dot drawable and dot the name of the uh, image let's check it okay we have empty screen and now i'm gonna press on set image as you see the image will be appearing here this is the most simple way to set an image whenever we have the fixed image into the rubber we can use this the other type is to convert the image to a bitmap and then set the bitmap onto image view when we use this okay when we want to use an image uh, from the external memory of the phone or maybe uh, using the camera and capturing the photo and then set it on image view we can use uh, this way for this purpose we need to build a value call it bitmap and then bitmap factory dot decode resources and this uh, represents the main activity and you see when I'm clicking on it the main activity will be glowing uh, dot resources uh, and again we have to write the address of the image that we want to uh, make it a bitmap like convert it to a bitmap and here is the address of the image okay let's check it together set image and the image will be set so for this purpose as you see i build a bitmap and then i set the bitmap here uh, into this line of code image view dot set image bitmap and the bitmap is this one okay the next way is to uh, use set image driver for this we need uh, to set image driver then we need a driver and we have to convert uh, address of the image into the driver for this we need context uh, compact and get drawable then again application context which is equal into this and r dot driver dot dot logo now let's check it again on the emulator again set image and the image will be set and the last way that we can use is uh, to use a uri which is the address of the image and it can be either the address of the image uh, inside the packages and folders of the application or into the memory and this is a good uh, way to use the photos from the memory the external storage of the phone or the, any device that you are using this application on it for this 
we have to build a URI a value URI and then the URI will be uh, converting the a string type which is the address of the image into the URI by this parse so this is android uh, dot uh, resource and here is the package of the application and I copied from here then a slash drawable which is this folder then slash uh, the name of the photo that I want to set on image view here then I have to call the URI here in this line of code and whenever I'm checking the application on the emulator it will be working so that was the four main type of setting an image onto an image view if you find any value in this video please remember to give me a thumbs up and subscribe the channel and uh, hit the bell button to be aware about new videos see you later in next videos thank you bye bye